I mean, it'll be a big part for us, especially the guys that have came back from the previous teams that's still here. I think the, the leadership and us being captains and us playing together, being used to each other and what each other does, I think leadership would be key as far as knowing what to expect for the guys that have played in the game to educate the other guys that are playing the game for the first time. Um, can I ask Art Keith Brown a question? Art Keith, you're one of the few of the Rattlers from last year that came over to the IFL. What have you noticed that was different, similar, or any thoughts about that? Um, you know, this is a new team. You know, there's a lot of young guys coming in. You know, and, uh, me coming back from last year. You know, there's a lot of more vets. You know, a lot of more, a lot of more older guys. But it was just the new guys. You know, just to try to. To try to give them the advice that you know that I have had playing in the AFL and playing in the IFL, so you know, it was just me telling them my advice and just getting them to accept it and kind of listen to me. Man, talk about growing up watching this team and now playing for them. Just the last, you know, the progression of your game and what it means to be a part of the storm. Uh, it's a blessing to be a part of the storm. Uh, uh, it's just I've been blessed, I think, to be able to. Watching my dad was a coach when I was a little boy, and now being grown up now and being part of this team and learning a lot every day and trying to do better. Corey, how awesome is it to be able to play at home? Well, that's one of the advantages in uh, in this league actually is to, to play at home, and that's something I've been thinking about. And, um, it's always great to play at home, and especially to have a championship game at home. There's there's nothing like that. You know? Usually you go on the road or you have a neutral site in, in other leagues, but in this league you get to play at home and you, you get to bring out all the stops, you know, anything you want to do before leading up, like if you want to do parades, anything, you know, anything you get the hype going, you can do it. And, and um, you know, we don't do things uh, too crazy, but we celebrate after we win, so uh, that's the plan. Coach Guy, um, you've been in many, many championship games in the AFL. Does this have any particular special meaning being in the IFL now and on the big stage uh, at the United Bowl? You know, I'm just, I'm happy for the players. Um, you know, they put the work in and uh, I'm not playing anymore. I just get to enjoy it, you know. Um, but, uh, you know, I, I, I'm happy for our organization and, uh, you know, to be able to change and start over you know from scratch and and uh you know just all the hours we put in in the off season we downloaded everybody's film watched their film we spent a lot of time watching Sioux Falls because i wanted to know why they've been winning so much so uh, we you know we adopted a lot of things that they did and i even asked coach uh, riggs at league meetings i couldn't understand why more teams you know uh, wasn't doing the things that they were doing you know scheme wise and you know, and he, his comment was, hey, you know, some would, um, you know, start doing it, but then they get away from it, you know, and uh, so that just told me I needed to stay with it, you know, and, and stay with it. So, um, so I just, you know, I, you know, I'm just happy all over, you know, with the, for, for the players, the organization, my assistant coaches, all those guys putting work in, I appreciate, you know, uh, our owner creating a spot for us to go, okay? And, uh, you know, uh, having the guts to make that move, uh, I think that says a lot about him too. So, um, you know, that's what it is. Uh, Coach Guy, what have that preparations been like this week? Any adjustments you guys have had to make to prepare for a round two with the storm? You want me to give you the game plan? <laughs> 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 you know, uh, we've been out in 115 degree weather, right? been hot um, and uh, you know I, I thought the guys had a great week of practice thought our focus was where it needed to be and uh, you know we, we used the bye week for the coaches to you know uh, put the game plan in and, and study film and you know the things that we need to do to try to win this game but uh, we implemented it on Monday and the players did, had a great job you know did a great job of practice all week so uh, I, I think we're also to the point um, you know as an organization, as a team, we're, we're tired of practicing. We just we want to go play the game. So uh, we're we're. Uh, but I, I thought they did. I thought they had a great, great week of practice.